Today we are going to talk about Ansible troubleshooting, specifically about failed to import the required Python library PI v m o m i message and enable Ansible for VMware. This fatal error message happens when uh, we are trying to execute some code against your VMware infrastructure without the necessary Python SDK for the VMware vSphere API. These circumstances are usually related to the configuration of your Ansible controller node and usually are not related to Ansible playbook. I'm Luca Burton and welcome in today's episode of Ansible Pilot. Demo time. The best way of talking about Ansible troubleshooting is to jump in a live demo to show you, practically, the failure to import the required Python library PI, v, m, o, m, i, and how to solve it. In this demo, I'm going to show you how to reproduce the error and fix using the PIP, the Python package manager, on a demo machine. Are you excited? Let's move it on! Welcome to my terminal. First of all, let me connect via SSH to my demo machine. DevOps is my username and demo.example.com. This is a simple machine just freshly installed and I copy a directory named VMware and inside some Ansible playbook requirement. So let me try to run this code. If you want line by line description is analyzed in another lesson. So uh, imagine you are running this code and uh, you are facing this error. The first things that you notice is the why you are getting this error. The error is module not found error no module named pi v i m and uh, if you go deeper there is a fatal error that say oh fail to import the required python library pi v m o m i so it look like uh, that the python library is not available or maybe you are using the wrong python interpreter now we can see that we are using the platform interpreter so the one of our distribution let me try to install this library in the current user. Oh, PIP is not working. Yes, because uh, probably it's Python free. Oh, a typo. Let me delete. PIP free. Okay. As you can see, PIP, the Python installer, is trying to install in the current user, but we got a permission denied error. So let me switch to root and try to install as uh, for all the distribution. So now the PIP install command is successful and version 7 is successfully installed. I already downloaded the file and have a dependency, so in your use case uh, you might see more text on your screen. But this is the important thing. Now is available for all the machine wide this library. So if we run again the same exact command, so Ansible playbook, let me specify the inventory and the playbook file. This time I'm expecting a different result. So as you can see, it's get waiting more time. This is a simple playbook just to list some information of a single virtual machine. So mm, it's, getting, it's taking more time to connect to the VMware infrastructure and returning the expected code. So, yay, success! We switched from red fatal error to a green OK status. So it looked like our troubleshooting process was successful and now we are ready to move on with our Ansible for VMware automation. Yay, great result! Now you know better how to troubleshoot the Ansible fail to import the required Python library PI the MOMI message. 
and you are ready to succeed in your Ansible for VMware playbook. Thank you for watching and uh, automate more with Ansible. See us on the next Ansible Pilot lesson and have a great day! This video is part of our Ansible automation program. Sign up today on www.ansiblepilot.com for uninterrupted exclusive video and so much fun!